Hey there, we're back with WSJ Lunch Break. I'm Wendy Bounce. A Greek shipping magnet remodels his Miami condo to mimic his yacht. You are looking at it right there. Join us now as Nancy Keats, our real estate reporter for the Wall Street Journal, and the architect on this project, Renee Gonzalez. Thanks so much to both of you for being here. So, Nancy, sky, air, water, so totally important to this homeowner. He actually wanted his home to be like this boat out on the seas. Who is he? He, as you said, is a Greek shipping magnet. His name is Ian Veratsakis, and he owns a company called Free Seas, which is based in Greece, which has uh, cargo ships that take cargo around the world. And now, Renee, yeah. uh, Renee you, are, you were the architect on this, and you were lucky enough to have your client ask you to spend about a week with him on this 125-foot boat. What did he want you to learn from that? And then let's talk about how you began to uh, uh, apply that to his Miami condo. It, it was an amazing experience. I think he really wanted me to just understand the way that he lives and the way that, that he li likes to live and, and his daily routines and the environment that he's surrounded by in this beautiful place uh, on the Greek islands. In, 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 in a sense, it's not that different from this location in Miami because he has an, an, an amazingly beautiful view of the Miami skyline of Biscayne Bay, the sky, the, the, the beautiful water we have in Miami. So there are these similarities. And I think he thought it would be interesting for me to try to capture those uh, qualities. What we learned from being there, or what I learned from being there is really that there is um, a lot of materials and a lot of qualities in a ship that could be applied to this project. Uh, one of the qualities is that we could uh, make things quite compact so that he could actually uh, have compartments, so to speak, that were quite small and very functional uh, that would uh, coexist and complement really a much larger space that was very lofty and would open to this view and reflect all these beautiful qualities uh, that we have here in Miami. And we used materials like teak uh, and resins that are uh, used on the boat as well. And a lot of, uh, let me jump in here, a lot of these interior walls being made of stainless steel vertical panels that kind of slide open and close to reveal new rooms. Nancy, talk to us about the overall cost of this renovation project. It was about $1.5 overall, and it took what was a sort of three-bedroom, kind of cramped uh, condo and opened it up completely and made it into a two-bedroom, but you could use the third room as a bedroom if you needed to. And it's a huge uh, terrace, about 800 square feet. 